Hey guys, it's Trevor Games, and welcome back to the video. I hope you guys are having the most spectacular day ever. And in today's video, today's video is definitely gonna be a lot more of a serious video. Today, I'm gonna be going over the topic of Bloxburg was sold for a hundred million dollars recently. This is a very, very recent thing. Some of y'all might have heard of this. Some of y'all might have not heard of this. Y'all might not even know that Bloxburg was sold, but it was. It's actually really crazy. Um, we don't know everything about like what's gonna be happening, but we do have a lot of pretty good information so far. So I'm gonna be going over everything we know and everything that's probably going to be happening to the game. For anybody wondering though, Bloxburg hopefully, from what we know right now and what we've been told, Bloxburg will not be deleted. Especially, I mean, considering it was bought for $100, $100 million dollars, which is absolutely crazy by the way, but considering it was bought for that much, I doubt the company would actually like delete the game. Okay, so let's start at the beginning, which was Bloxburg was sold for $100 million, which some people think that price is honestly crazy, but considering you have to pay 25 Robux just to get in the game and they have all these game passes, and literally people buy things at Bloxburg like all the time, it's honestly not that far off, but that's besides the point. Bloxburg was sold for $100 million and they were sold to a Swedish company. The company's name is Embracer and they actually make games like actual games. Like they're not like any kind of like Roblox like development team or like any type of like Roblox studio and they don't really have any affiliation with Roblox at all. Like this is their first thing like involving Roblox, which is why a lot of people were also kind of confused on why they decided to like invest in Bloxburg specifically. But like it was because they thought like the game has like been profitable, which I guess you could say so. If you bought it for a hundred million dollars, if it's worth that much, then I would say yeah. So far in terms of Bloxburg, nothing has changed yet. Like they literally today just did their New Year's update. So I'm assuming Quept is still in control and I believe the company will be taking like fully control or like take command in the game or something after 2023. So tell me that I'm like probably after tomorrow, the company will start like working, developing on the game. But so far nothing has changed yet. In terms of Bloxburg itself, now we don't know too much of what they're doing. Like we only know like a little bit of information so far, but they did say that they would probably be adding like a lot more new things to the game, such as like building tools and like little towns as well. So honestly, this is kind of very exciting for like a lot of Bloxburg players. They even mentioned that they might even add mini games, which I don't know how they're gonna fit that into Bloxburg considering right now Bloxburg is more of like a kind of like realistic kind of game where you like build and like you do like RPs and stuff. But I think this is gonna be very interesting like to see what new take they take like on the game of Bloxburg. Personally though, I feel like I'm very excited to see what happens. I feel like they, get, they might do a lot of good updates. Hopefully they do a lot of good updates, I'm hoping, because Bloxburg is literally like one of my favorite games ever. So I really hope the game Bloxburg doesn't get ruined. Let's hope that Coeptis made the right choice, guys. Honestly, we can only just hope at this point, but I, I think so. I think they have a lot of great ideas and if they can like execute them properly, I think we're gonna have a pretty good game. I want to know what y'all think though. What are y'all's thoughts on this like new Bloxburg change? Like what, like do y'all think it's for the better? Do y'all think it's gonna get worse? I honestly, I think it's gonna be very interesting. I, I'm like kind of leaning towards like, I kind of, I'm like excited for it, but like I don't know how it's gonna go. Like this could go either way. So it's gonna definitely be a very, very interesting year for Bloxburg, but that's gonna be all for today's video. This is also the last video of the 2022 year, guys. We had such a good year though. I wanna tell you, say thank you so much for all the support we had this year guys we literally hit 2k subscribers well we're now over 2k subscribers we had so many exciting build battles and events it was honestly this was such a fun year thank you so much for all the support i have so many more fun like events and things coming up in the future it's gonna be so much fun so stay tuned and i hope you all have the most spectacular day ever and i'll see y'all next time bye